Food at the moment is taken for granted. The population of the world is increasing, the amount of land is decreasing, the climate is changing. Agriculture will have to work in sustainable ways, in ways that people can afford food. The goals of the International Rice Research Institute are to take part in the global effort to transform agriculture. We handle rice science from many different angles. One of the major challenges in working with people that are in so many locations is that the amount of data that is coming at us is exponentially increasing. We started using analytics in a serious way in our finance environment. With the help of, of partners like Clix, we started visualizing data, making data dynamic. And our scientists, they started saying, why can't we do this for our science as well? For our work, we collect data from different countries. We used to spend about three to six months in one single data set. And that means that the results also would be delayed for a further few months. Now with the use of analytics, we take one month to pull this data together to monitor the trends over a period of time in a particular location and look at the overall picture so we can do our work more tailored to the needs of the countries. It is easier to show a government official a live dynamic information graph showing them future trends and many what-if scenarios than the old style of producing spreadsheets of data. We are really, really interested in working in genomics information. Our dream is to create a digital gene bank of the future where all of the accessions in our gene bank are fully sequenced and can be mined and explored through an analytics engine. I believe that part of Erie's transformation of the rice sector can be in making life for rice farmers easier. This requires us to really transform this whole ecosystem and that is now the mainstay of our use of analytics.